Hey everyone, this is going to be my second unboxing video. Uh, I get a lot of boxes here at the Mineral Exchange, so I think this is going to be a cool little regular thing to do. Let's see how I can open this thing. This is a heavy one. Probably get some comments saying about how dumb I open boxes, but you know, gets it done. <laughs> All right. That was packaged pretty nicely. This is a box filled with London kilos. London Inglehard kilos. Check these babies out. Car number one. This is a rare, very rare T prefix. Inglehard London kilo. Very cool. Very cool. Another just beautiful P series. That one's crazy nice. Look at the pore lines on that. Let's see if I can zoom in on that. There we go. These London kilos just have some of the most beautiful pores I've ever seen. That's why I always am uh, doing everything I can to try to get these in from the UK. Great history behind the Makata and Goldsmith Company. The counter stamp right there. It's one of the earliest uh, bullion companies. It's dated, uh, I guess, Moses Makata was back in the 1600s when he started this. Then Goldsmith came on and it became Makata and Goldsmith. And I think the company's still around doing something in the industry. I have to do a little bit more research about it. But I do know that they have a very strong name in the industry and they were one of the first pioneers. So very cool stuff. If you don't have one of these in your collection, I always recommend them. They're just hard to come by, especially in really nice shape. Now this one right here, I have people pulling my arms in every direction for this bar. Because the X series prefix. And it's in very, very good shape considering uh, being such a rare bar. The pores on it is very cool. Look at the waffle back design on it. Very cool. I got a U here. I left them in the bag. Somebody made a comment last time if you touch it with your raw hand. Uh, I'll be using a glove from now on. I, I Sometimes I use my hand, sometimes I use a glove. Most of the time, though, I do use a glove. Uh, it's a kind of a kind of a different thing in, in uh, vintage bullion to be wearing a glove, but that's been catching on lately. If you have any comment on that, leave a comment down below on what you think about wearing a glove when you hold these bars. I got a cool little black glove. So... I wanted to show one of these off. Alright, thank you all for watching. If you like these videos, 
please give a thumbs up and subscribe. That was an unboxing of six Englehard London Kilos. Thank you all. Have a great day.